Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Arguably the second most popular tourist activity in Dubrovnik after visiting the old town is the Dubrovnik cable car. In today's video, we're gonna take a ride all the way to the top of the mountain. Stay tuned until the end because you don't wanna miss this stunning view. I will also share additional information on this tourist activity. So I hope you guys are gonna enjoy the video. The Dubrovnik cable car is located within walking distance of old town. And we managed to go there with a stroller, a toddler and an infant so it's easily accessible by families. The operating times vary depending on the month of the year. The cable car will also run as soon as it is full. So if the cable car is not full yet, you may need to wait a few minutes. The last departure of the day from the lower station will always be 30 minutes before the closing time. And these are the operating times throughout the year. The Dubrovnik cable car has quite a few facilities, the most popular being the Panorama restaurant and bar. This restaurant is pretty expensive, so I would advise you to just have your meal in the old town. You'll pay a lot less. And if you like, you can always have a beverage at the Panorama restaurant while you enjoy the view. They also have an amphitheater, an orchard pearl shop, and a coin blacksmithing shop. So apart from actually taking the ride up to the mountain, at the top you can also experience a buggy safari. And as I've mentioned earlier, there's a hiking trail that goes all the way to the top of the mountain. The hiking trail is 1.25 kilometers and it's 4,100 feet above sea level. And in terms of health and safety requirements in Croatia, at the time when we went on vacation, which was October 2021, whenever you enter the building or a taxi, or in this case, the cable car, you have to always wear your mask. Your hands will also be sanitized before entering the cable car at the bottom of the station, as well as at the top of the mountain when you are coming down. The ride to the top takes about 3 minutes and it reminded me a lot of the cable car ride in Cape Town. And for those 3 minutes guys, believe me, you don't want to blink. That's how stunning the view is going to the top. So if you don't plan on dining at the Panorama restaurant and bar or experiencing the buggy safari, there's not much else to do at the top of the mountain. Therefore, most probably, you won't spend more than 15 to 30 minutes at the top of the mountain, which is similar to Table Mountain in Cape Town. At the bottom guys you can see a stunning view of Dubrovnik especially of Old Town. If you'd like to support the channel please like the video and subscribe and this link will take you to our video covering the entire travel process going to Croatia. Mm -hmm. 